Breaking news, Bassmaster Elites has updated the no information rule for 2025. That's what we're going to talk about right now. If you like this kind of content, click that like and subscribe button, become part of the team and family, and thank you. Thank you for all the new fans, members, subscribers, people who comment, people who are interactive on the channel. I really do appreciate it. But if you're not a subscriber, you should be because it's free and all you got to do is click that button and you're part of the team and family. So thank you. And let me just say beforehand, I've made another video already that's going to go on after this, but there was a rule or something that was slipped into the bass schedule for 2025, talking about how the, the no information will be, would start to be enforced on January 1st. And many, many, as every angler I knew was not happy about it. And it's, really takes someone to apologize and say when they're wrong because honestly we're we're all wrong there's always going to be time you're going to be wrong and how you deal with it or how you go with life and, and learn from it really shows what kind of person or in this case business they are and bass has made a decision to change that no information rule and i'm going to read it no information rule change for the 2025 elites Friday, Bass announced its 2025 Elite Series schedule featuring a diverse fishery that should set the stage for an exciting, unpredictable season. Along that release, the organization announced a change in the timing of the no information rule stating that January 1st, 2025 as the start date of the rule. Today, that changed. After consistent feedback from the Elite Pros, Bass will revert back to the rule stating that starting immediately, September 8th, 2024, anglers may not get information from any source that is not publicly available on the 2025 Elite Series venues or the 2025 Bass Pro Shops Bassmaster Classic, presented by Jockey Outdoors. Additionally, Bass is adding EQ anglers to this ruling. To be clear, effective immediately, both elite anglers and EQ anglers are prohibited from getting outside information on the 2025 elite venues. Let me just say, thank you, Bass, but thank you for listening to what the anglers were saying. This is a huge jump. This is, this is positive movement forward. This is really positive movement forward. There are a lot of people that just, as I said, that don't admit when they're wrong and they double down. And doubling down is not where you want to do it. If you're wrong, you're wrong. Just admit it. And by what they put in there for January 1st was wrong. And the elite anglers obviously were not happy and stated it to Bass. And here, just a few days later, two or three, two actually, they've changed the ruling. So congratulations to Bass. Congratulations to the elite anglers too for getting this done quickly. This is the kind of progression that you want to see to build for the future. And this was the correct decision to make. The correct decision on all levels. So congrats, Bass. You knocked it out of the park on this one, so thank you. So what do you think? Do you think this was the right decision? Because if you're watching this video, I, I believe it's the right decision. To go out and buy waypoints and stuff like that, I just don't think it's the right, the right thing to do. But what do you think? So comment below and tell me what you think in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hitting that like and subscribe button. Remember, take a kid fishing. I don't know why I'm already pointing. Get your fish on. I will talk to you very, very soon. That probably was pretty stupid. Thank you. Cheers and tight lines.